Hey guys, it's me, Chance again, back with a little video. It's I know it's been a while since I've uploaded, but school has started again, so haven't had as much time to work on videos. But this is just a little project I was working on again. Um, there's nothing special about it. All you are is a character and you can shoot, but it just shoots out particles and stuff. Um, noteworthy things about it is you have knockback, so you can kind of rocket jump up, which is pretty nice. And there's a bloom effect on everything. So that's pretty nice. Um, I'll show you the code for the knockback right now. So it's pretty simple. It's just when you shoot, okay, this is all for the particles. But you just, mm, so up here, we have an extra velocity variable. And when we move and slide, we just have velocity plus extra velocity. But basically we just set extra velocity dot y that equals zero. And this isn't this line isn't mandatory, it's just a little me messing around. But then we have extra velocity equal to so the global position minus of your player minus your mouse position dot normalized. So it's one basically. Or zero one whatever direction and then you just have multiplied by the force you want so it will knock you back in the opposite direction you're shooting nothing too complicated it's pretty nice um for the bloom effect that's pretty simple also let's just i have it um you just make a world environment and then you just i'll start from the beginning so i'll clear this and actually, I'm going to delete this world environment that's on the player because you don't need it. You don't want it there. And let's make a new one. So world environment. And then you just put new environment. Then you go to background. Canvas mode. And then you want to go to glow. Enable it. And then you can set the intensity you want. You want blend mode to be additionative. And then you just go into wherever you want to have bloom. And then you just change the visibility. Anything with visibility can have bloom. So you just go to modulate. And then you click raw. And then depending on how you have it, you can increase the bloom for it or not. You also change the bloom in levels for glow. So you probably want the strength to be weaker or the tension to be higher. Um, I also like to click this by cubic upscale so it doesn't look all cubey with the glow. And you just change a couple things around until you get it how you like. Like, <laughs> imagine playing a game like this. Oh, that'd be so fun. But no one wants that much. So let's just lessen it. And that looks about good. Yeah. So, yeah, that's about it. Nothing too special. Pretty simple. But, yeah. If you guys want me to do, like, any other types of tutorials or game challenges or whatever you guys have in mind, comment them below because I'm starting to run out of some ideas. been doing most of the stuff I wanted to show you guys. So, I need to get my creative brain juices flowing. But, yeah, that's about it. And... Yeah, I'll see you guys in the next video. Bye.